Hello and welcome to Mile High Reefers. I'm Scott Anderson, and I've had several of my subscribers ask me about keeping more than a pair of clownfish in a tank. And I've actually been doing this for a couple years now with pretty good luck. So mine are Ocellaris, and I've got two pair. One that hosted this cl clam, and I've got another pair clear on the other side of the tank. Now, rather than cut it and pan it and do all that, I thought I'd go that method so that you can really see how big this tank is, right? And get an idea of really how big it is. Now, this is important in part of why I get away with two pairs of clownfish in my tank. Now, clownfish have a hierarchy, and if you have too many and too small of a tank, they tend to fight. Now, I get away with it because I've each set up territories, one on each side of the tank. Now, I don't claim to be a clownfish expert, but Nemo, who is my biggest female clown, I've had her for 10 years. So I've got to be doing at least something right. But you guys really wanted to know how I'm keeping four clowns in a tank, and really, that's all it is. It's just a big tank, and they're able to keep separate territories.